guys, Floodmine14. Welcome back to, I think this will probably be the final, uh, uh, not, not necessarily the final for the grind session. In fact, no, certainly not. But for this, you know, kind of first, you know, batch of episodes I'm doing. Uh, yeah, uh, by the way, I realized that, uh, uh, I, I was checking ed editing between parts, and I realized, like, uh, I didn't really finish what I was saying about the passwords. So, in this game, you get star chips. What are star chips used for? Uh, you can enter, you know, random numbers, or probably a better idea, you can look up numbers of cards. And, um, yeah, uh, basically, like, let's say a weak card, like, um... Uh, what's a weak card? Baby, not, not Baby Dragon. Baby Dragon's pretty good. Let's say a card like Time Wizard. It's actually a really good card. Maybe in this game it costs 5,000 star chips. You know, you just look up the code, put in the number, and, you know, voila. Uh, you get the card right there. So that's what star chips are for. And as you see, we have 76 star chips. So, yep. And some, uh, the max number of star chips you can go up to in this game is 999. Nine nine. I don't know if I said that wrong one, right? But uh, six nines. Pretty crazy stuff. But uh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, we're just gonna start off versus Villager three. Uh, where is my? But yeah. After this section, uh, after this video here, I think that's gonna be it for a couple days for me. And then I'm gonna do some editing and stuff. But uh, anyway, we'll turn up the volume up slightly. And uh, yeah, wish me luck. And it's 12:53, so we'll go to about 1:23 or so. All right, just kind of a note for my personal records. Um, ooh, do these use? This makes firecracking in Bills of the Roses. I don't know if it does here. No, no. Okay. No firecracking. That's okay. Alright, he's not fusing, that's a good sign. And he didn't attack us either, that's strange. Oh, we got Flower Wolf. Shall we? We shall. Wait, what's on the field? Weather. Mm, yeah, Aquas don't fuse when I use AKG. Alright. Um. I guess we'll try to interpret We saw, um. Nice. We saw one attack from Flower Wolf. But yeah, it was more of a did I don't think we showed one of Flower Wolf's animations, so let's see what the other one is. Well <laughs> that's cool. Turns like a top. What you got, Flower Wolf? Bunkai. Sinbon Zakara. Hagioshi. Oh man, that was cool. That was cool. Nice. <laughs> Attaboy, Wolfie. Yeah, buddy. Okay. So, we've seen both of his attacks now. And that, sec that second one, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright, we'll switch this to defense. Make sure we don't take any damage. Alright. There you go, Villager 3. Throating Shark. I was right to go in defense mode. Alright. Let's see here, we got zombies, rocks, uh, oh, I guess it's stone ghost time. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Oops, cancel. Let's save the jar, because the jar can go with spellcasters. Ah, we're gaming, we're gaming. Uh, let's go with Mercury. Okay. okay, nothing super effective. I guess we'll watch stone ghost, because we've never seen this attack. Yeah. How you guys doing today? Uh, today is still May 12th, 2023. And right now, I'm just chilling, man. <laughs> to me, these grinding episodes, they don't even feel like, I don't know, they feel somewhere in between, uh, you know, normal episodes and just flat out no commentary episodes. I don't feel pressure to <laughs> make good commentary on these. I mean, because 
it's very clear that, you know, I'm just straight up grinding, so. Yeah, which is kind of nice. It's kind of, it's kind of relaxing. It's, what's more relaxing than usual, let me say it that way. You know, because normally I can get too worried about certain stuff, you know. Like, oh man, the camera angle, or this, this, and my mic, like, oh man. I mean, but here it's just like, you know, or, or like doing the voices, you know, because normally there is a lot of reading. Uh, so, okay, I had to think there for a second. But like, yeah, yeah. So normally I think about a lot of stuff or like worry about like, oh man, how's this going to be and how's this or that going to do? But yeah, here in the grinding episode, it's just like, it doesn't really matter. Like the main thing is like, okay, you see how many starships I won, the rank, and what card we get. That's really all that matters. The rest is just, just gravy, just gravy. All right, we finally got the spellcaster. It's time for Shioni. I didn't even check the Guardian Star. I really should get used to that because honestly, like if the stats of the monster are close enough, not paying attention to the Guardian Star, that can cost you a game. It can lead you to, you know, once we get the weight later down the line, it can lead you to a game over, which would be very unfortunate. Uh, but yeah, let's just flower wolf it. Trap Master, ooh. And normally that card has an effect in the game. It's kind of like a flood monster, like uh, Arm Ninja. But instead of destroying tra spells, Trap Master destroys traps. You know, obviously. Uh, you know, obviously no effects on this game, so. Frog the Jam. No thank you. Alright, Villager 3. Let's, let's, let's go again. Let's go again. One more again, please. Alright, now what time did I say? I said, uh, 123, right? Somewhere around there. 120? I forgot what I said. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Right now, it is 12.59. So we're doing great on time. Fusions, let's see, we got a female. Uh, we got zombies. Well, I guess it's stone ghost time again. Yep, okay. Stone ghost. Fusing Villager 3, I'm good. <laughs> the guy just casually drops dragons on me like it ain't nothing. Okay, well, uh, uphill battle. Let's start throwing stuff away, shall we? Let's throw away these two guys. Yeah. See ya, McMull Zombie. We're in uh, dangerous circumstances here. Hmm, what's good against Moon? So I'm fusing dragons on, but I was like, oh no, if he throws a thunder on, <laughs> might be time to go for the Geki, the Rageki. But Stone D, we can take Stone D, it's only got 2,000. Uh, let's see here, let's see here. Uh, I guess we'll dump this, and this, and this. That'll be Magical Ghost. Won't be enough, but uh, you know. Maybe I should have kept the spellcaster. Ooh, so don't choose Pluto. Don't choose Pluto. Okay. Good to know. Do not choose Pluto. As long as you don't mix a thunder with that stone D, I'm good. Alright, well, we avoided the 2000. What's this? Crowding Sharp? 1100. Okay. Okay. Builder 3 putting up a fight here. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. This should work. This should work. Uh -huh. And huzzah! Foul germs in the clutch. So like I said, don't choose Pluto. Uh, I guess we'll try Jupiter. Yeah. Yeah, this will be an epic battle. Let's show this. Queen of Autumn Leaves versus Stone D. Luckily for us, we drew that power up because uh, if he had gone to defense mode for some reason, we couldn't have beaten Stone D no matter what. So and that would have been bad because, yeah, Villager 3, this guy does have Thunder types in his deck. We were just really, 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 really lucky. He 
didn't draw one. Or he wasn't smart enough to play one. Ah, Leaf Hurricane. Nice. Nice. Everyone knows rock types are super affected by, you know, grass types are super affected by rock types. Come on, Stone D. Bro, you're, you're, you're like a grappler. You took times four damage from that. You can't handle my Leaf Tornado, son. <laughs> All right, it looks like we're back in control of this duel. Although, he, he has a monster. He might fuse. Oh, on the field? Yeah. Oh, okay, it's just armor. Yeah. Ooh, and it's got zero defense. Big mistake, pal. Big mistake. All right, let's see what we got. Fish. Uh, no fusions I can think of. No, wait, we have World of Warcraft Warrior, right? Yeah, this is World of Warcraft. Yeah. Okay. He has zero, so we'll just... <laughs> if he switches to something with zero to defense, you can kill literally anything. So that's a way to win, I guess. Man, he started off good, though. Dragon Zombie into Stone Knee, and... Okay, ooh, good. I'm glad we finally get to try this out. So usually a Pyro with a Beast will make Fluffy. Let's give it a try. Buddy, but Lucky is here. All right, uh, let's go with Mars. I think I did Pluto last time, but I can't remember. So we might. Either way, uh, Fluffy's got a very cool tag, and I don't mind showing it twice. We'll save the tag. So, <sighs> well, the comeback is real. We're in good shape now. Close one. But yeah, as you guys can see, villagers two and three, they ain't nothing to mess with. So oh a haze attack. Come on. Almost looked like I was using smoke screen there. Ooh. Yeah, I definitely prefer the Pluto attack on uh flame. Cerberus, but uh, oh well. World of Warcraft Warrior and Leaf Tornado. All right. Good thing I left Vile Germs in my deck, <laughs> man. Cause yeah, like last recording session, I'm like, man, maybe I should take this card out. No. <laughs> Good thing I didn't. Good thing I didn't, because I seriously considered taking it out. And oh, once again, we have. Metal Greymon. Gotta love it, gotta love it. Any stars? Nope. Oh, but Mars is weak against Neptune. That's good to know. That makes sense, though. Mars is known for being a fiery planet. So being weak to water makes sense. Alright. I'm sure we'll get, like, a beep out here because we did take some damage, but, you know... Or a, ooh, a C. But Armel is honestly a pretty good monster, considering we got a C rank. Uh, yeah, that's actually a great monster. I'll show you guys it here. It's got like 1300 defense, right? Yeah, dude. What the? Got this for a C rank? A strange warrior who manipulates three fearsome blades with both its hands and its tail. Yeah, so. I don't know what warriors we have in this deck, but uh, any of them, we can take out any of them. Well, this is a female though. So, uh, yeah, we'll take out Doron, the Explorer. Maybe I'll take out something else. Maybe I'll take out, yeah, because 1300 is pretty solid. Let's see in terms of points. Okay, the bats are kind of weak. Are the bats my only machines? Looks like they are, yeah. Okay, so let's take out something weak. Yeah, because 1300 ain't bad. Ain't bad at all. Let's see. Um, Want to leave the jar. Maybe I'll take this out finally. Mm. Yeah, I hate to do it because I know for sure Fungi of the Must fuses with some stuff. It's just I forgot the formula, so. Mm. You know. Better to have something reliable. Okay, ooh, right, yeah, that's pretty good to have. Uh, we can go with, uh, hmm, wood remains? I 
guess. Yeah. That's what we got. Well, we got our power up in case we're in a pinch, but more importantly, we got Raya Geki in case we're in a real pinch. So, this school, we should be good. We should be good. Defense mode, I like to see it. Ooh. Okay. Um, let's do. Wait, does a fish work? This will work or not. Ooh, it does not in this game. That's so okay. So in um Duels of the Roses, a fish with a dragon will make Kyrie shit right away. And aquas and dragons don't work, but in this game, that's gonna be so hard for me to not mix up. You know what? You know, because I'm just so used to Duels of the Roses. But in this game, like an Aqua plus a Dragon will be a Spike Caesar. And then you can get it even further to Kairush. That's going to be so hard for me to remember. But, uh... I'll try a Storm Breath. I'll try to remember that. But that's... Side note, we seem to draw Wicked Dragon way, 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 way more than we draw Yamatano and Dragon Score. For whatever reason. But, uh, hey, we got two dragons. It's really either of them are good in my book. What you got? No, don't kill my dragon. Aww. My 100. Yep, and now I draw this, which would remain Stone D. Uh, what we got? Just what remains. Well, I guess we're going to Armanite. Let's do this. Check the stars, because we've got the same stats. Oh! Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That's exactly what I was talking about. Use that Guardian Star. Alright. So we're going to do this on Prisma. And we're going to show what happens when both monsters have the same attack in this game. Because I have yet to show that, right? I'm pretty sure I haven't shown that yet. Heck, even I don't remember what the, what the animation looks like after. So This will be a treat for all of us. And plus we get to see Sam get his attack. So a little something new. A little something new. Oh man, Sandy looks a lot different in this game. A lot of extra brown coloring. Supersonic, electronic, hypnotic, poke your fresh. Nice. Man, would remain. You shoot that for a long time. What you got, saying in? Let's show, show the world what you're working with. Oh, triple I beam attack. Who could have saw that coming? Honestly, that did look pretty cool, though. Like, right before he attacks, how, how he lit up. That was pretty baller. <laughs> and just like in Duels of the Roses, it just kind of pans over <laughs> when they have the same attack. Pans over after the fact. But it shows my monster dying first. <laughs> Alright. We're in good shape now. 
now villager two ain't got no monsters, so we're facing two or three, I forget. Uh, so we can make stone ghost. Let's do that. Stone ghost. Alright, we'll go with Uranus. Alright, that's next. Oh man, same points. That's happened like four times in this one duel. That's so odd, it almost never happens. But whatever. Uh, there we go, baby. Ooh, I wonder if it works with this spellcaster. Let's try it. Because this spellcaster is different. This one's a... Uh, yeah. Let's try it with this one. Because I'm, I'm just curious. Okay, okay. That's, I'm glad that does work, because if it didn't... You know, I would have kicked the uh, ancient sorcerer from our deck because, you know, like I like I said in uh, episode like four, if you get like a pseudo beast, a pseudo beast or a pseudo type, a type that you know doesn't work when it's supposed to, you gotta kick it out. So I'm glad we got to try ancient sorcerer there because I wasn't for sure uh, that that would work. Okay, let's try mystical sand with violet. This shouldn't work, but, you know. Okay, so, so far, Vile Germs only seems to work with, um, Queen of Autumn Leaves, and that's not good. Although it did save us to start this episode. Alright, we'll probably get, like, a C or D rank here. B, weather. Yeah, we already have weather. We have good hot weather, cold weather, warm weather, all kind. All right. So we'll see. Okay. And I'm doing that just in case my phone cuts off. But we should have time for like, uh, if they're really quick, two more, but probably just one more. Uh, let's do Villager 2 again. Let's do Villager 2 again. But for sure, we have time for one more, so. But I wanted to say before the game, like, froze or something. Man. <laughs> like it did in the first episode. Alright. Ooh, no machine yet. But since we drew Tomazaurus, it's like, it's almost fate that we're going to draw a machine. Just watch it. Just watch. Uh, also, it's Laughing Flower. Spell or trap card. That's weird. Okay, so this is a female and a rock, right? Okay, yeah. The mystical sand back again. Uh, what's that trap card, buddy? Oh, it's not a trap. Is it a spell? Did he did he set down dark hole? That dank abyss. So weird. We've never seen him play a spell or trap. That's 200 effect damage. Torike! Yeah, that'd be nice to get that wind up from this guy. I think he can. Uh, okay, so we got Dragon Zombie. Will this work with Dragon Zombie? It shouldn't, but maybe. Just maybe. No. Okay. Ooh, Guardian Star. Oh, right, because he said he set Final Flame to start. He didn't set a single monster, which was so weird. But, uh... Oh, we actually did draw a machine. I'm shocked, but we did draw a little D. All right, let's go into... Spike Seedra. Yeah, Mercury. And this should be the end of the game, yeah, for sure. Aki Kai... Aki Is that what that is? I'm not sure how you say that. And spike secret attack. Alright, good, good, good. We're doing good here. We're doing good. That was a quick one. That was a quick one. Alright. And we get. Not a good card, but we did get five stars, so that's good. And I'll just show you guys just for, you know. 
for those of you interested. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah, strange one-eyed monster armed with a dangerous spear. <laughs> Can't be that dangerous. It's only got 450 attack. What? <laughs> All right, last duel. All right. Raigeki, love to see it. All right, we get the machine. We're halfway there. Uh, let's get rid of these two cards. Tried this with some fusions as well, but didn't have like a rock or anything. Ah, oh, good defense mode. All right. Ooh, we got a dragon, so we can make uh, middle dragon. Very nice. No. Uh, maybe I should. Yeah, you know what? You went defense. Let's try this. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I was just like, yeah. I mean, the AI went to defense mode. Why would I? Well, not not just attack my 900 point monster. Okay. All right. All right. Still defending. There we go. Okay. Mystical Sam time. Ooh. Or do I want to go Ushioni? We'll go Oni. Oh yeah. All right. Oni time. Guardian Star. Okay, no. Good to get in the habit of check, though. Ooh, same. Same game. Okay. Alright. Ooh, she don't need direct attack. We got this, guys. We got this. <laughs> Alright. Still defending. Uh, hmm. I guess we could make a uh, spike seed right here. Wouldn't be too bad, Nicole. Alright. And that should be the game. So we attack with Spike Seeker. And Warrior. Okay. Water Gun. Alright. And then we got Ushioni. Nice. Alright. Well, that'll be it. Let's see what the last card we win is for today. we get is binding chain hmm I don't really like that card yeah it's well unless it's something different in this game but I think it's a monster with like a thousand attack yeah this creature corners its enemies and seals away their power yeah in uh, duels of the roses this uh permanently spell binds all warrior monsters I think but uh yeah yeah this game, not so good. Alright, we'll see. There we go. Alright, guys, well, that is going to be it for now, for today. Uh, yeah, thanks for joining me. And, um, yeah, if you want, uh, feel free to like and subscribe and all that. But, uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys all next time. All right. Have a good day.